My name's Andy Minion. I'm the director of the Rick Centre here at the University of East London. Hello, my name is Gosia Kwiatkowska. I'm the centre manager. I run and develop lots of multimedia advocacy courses. Um, and I teach on postgraduate and undergraduate levels. My understanding of uh, multimedia advocacy is it's the use of the tools and, and the processes uh, of multimedia production as a way in which to help people to have a voice and to take control of their lives. Multimedia advocacy is the conveying of preferences and viewpoints by using pictures, sound, video and words. Funnily enough, I think multimedia advocacy is for everybody. Most of us carry in our pockets nowadays a multimedia recording device with our mobile phones. We'll have a camera there, we'll have a means of displaying pictures, of showing videos, of sending pictures and videos to each other, of storing text. We all use multimedia day to day as part of how we organise our thinking, communicate with each other and reinforce our memories. So um, really I, I think multimedia advocacy is for everyone. But what I'd add is if you have some challenges because of an intellectual disability or a communication disability with getting your message across, with um, taking charge of your day-to-day your -day life, then multimedia advocacy is particularly for you. Because for us, it's a convenience. But I think for people with an intellectual disability, it can make the difference between being included and being excluded.